Good morning, good afternoon, good morning, good night, you beautiful souls. How the devil are a yam? Welcome to another Sam K video. <laughs> oh dear, people coming to the Why does everyone think I hate Trucker Tim? But I actually really love his stuff. <laughs> I love the, engin like, the engineering stuff, it's bloody brilliant. But everyone seems to think I hate him. I don't know why, but okay. Uh, do you know, didn't you do a whole video? Yeah, I did, yeah. Yeah, yeah I did make a whole video about him, and I did say Tim will fix it. But, oh well, we're here now. But if you actually watch the video, I didn't actually ever say anything bad about it, did I? I just assumed I did. So, yeah. Oh well, ran over. We're on the N25. In the endless roadworks for new refuge areas that we didn't bloody need in the first place if they just stuck in a hard shot. Yeah, we're on the N25, we're just about to come off with Junction 26. No, we're not going to the very overpriced but very nice truck stop. That people still get robbed in anyway. Um, yeah, we're going down to near Chingford. And we're not loaded. We're actually going to get loaded. Why are we loaded? Because we're empty, that's why. No, we're, um, yeah, go ahead and collect six pieces of stuff. To take down to a hospital in Yeovil, which I think has been on video before. I can't remember. I've done so many now, and yet nobody watches them. Why do I do this? So yeah, that's a that's a long and a short of it for today. But you know what? We're going to come off Junction 26. I mean, I could have gone down the A10. I could have gone down the M11. But you know what? I never come this way, so I thought I'd treat myself. I don't know what I'm treating myself to, but I thought I'd treat myself. But yeah. Lovely job, lovely job. But yeah, bit of a weird weekend. That'll probably be a separate video. But this weekend, we might, might, hopefully, if it comes off, might have a good weekend for the pictures. But I might be in a certain truck driving related magazine. Class two, but not classless. I've already seen a headline. Yeah. Somebody has now recognised the fact that my boss actually has quite a tidy fleet and wants to photograph it, so yeah. And you know what? I obviously cleared it with boss man first, there you go, there's Junction 26 and as usual half his fleet ain't moving. Uh, there's a version of my Volvo sitting there. I'll see it. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I thought everyone was going, oh, so it's all, we'll wash our trucks, all the lads are like, including my boss, are like, no, 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 we'll do it, yeah, we'll eventually all the lorries will wash by Friday, yeah, now we're all coming on Saturday. Oh, Christ, boys, all right. Yeah, so that's that. Yeah, 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 so, um, so yeah. Oh. There's a reason why I didn't like this way, it's this. Oh, well, we're here now. So, yeah, no, we're uh, gonna load six pieces. I don't know what these pieces are. I have measurements of the pieces, I'm just loading six pieces. No idea. We're we'll probably park up on the A33 tonight because. Is the road down there? A35? I think. I think. No, A36. Why not? It's just, it's just, there's no lay-bys in the ones that are, the ones there are not, not exactly what you call great. So, um, but yeah. Yeah, now I remember, there was, this was the reason I don't like coming this way. I don't know, seems sort of, want to trim the hedges. Well, I do love the name of that pub, the Woodbine. That's what Kev came out smoking when he was born. Oh, well, anyway. Cheap food. Right, nearly here. Gone for a for us. We can't expect me to get off of every forest in there right in the film. So, hmm, hmm. Santa's saying make a U-turn before I can turn into this place. Hmm. Interesting. Yes. Hmm. Hmm. That's why we saw this on boys. So. Hmm. Humming, 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 humming. Take it forever. Don't you root for both of us? Actually, actually, you know what? You know what? I don't think we'll be making a U-turn. I think the sat-nav's having a giraffe, mate. 
Lovely. That'll do. May hit a few trees. But we're going to turn right straight onto this estate. Oh, look, there's screw fix. But of course, now, oh, and it's just turned. But you know what? Everything's coming up, Sam. Beautiful. Tell you what, but councils, if anybody from a council watches this, trim bloody trees! All right, so we're nearly here. Oh, God, that oh. Got high blood pressure then. Ooh. I should, you know what? It's not healthy to be angry, is it? It's just not healthy. Oh, I think, I think it's down here, isn't it? Oh, God, what a place to park that about. I mean, not impossible, just awkward. Boy, oh, it's, uh, it doesn't look like this place is one way as well. Or oh, I'm just driving the wrong way down the wrong way. But oh, is this you? Is this the establishment that I need? Oh lord, is it you? Yeah, number 17. There it is. Right. And you know what? We're gonna reverse it because just because we can. Saves I'm trying to have to turn around when we're loaded. It's a very specific weight, 6,000 kilograms, on the nose apparently, oh, I don't think it will be that, I reckon it'll be less. Well it was number 17 wasn't it? Yeah. Stunning. Let's do, I feel I can see the gear right there. Right, let's do loadings. Oh, there's us loaded. Not a lot really, is it? Hmm. Hmm. I bet that doesn't move. Right, check out this lump of paperwork. This is almost as thick as my arm, although that's not that thick. Let's put in the postcode of where we're going. I've been told to go back up the M11. Don't go back out the way I came in, apparently. I, he never really gave me a reason why, but... Uh, I'm more inclined to listen to the locals. Although that has steered me wrong before. I think so. Lovely. Postcodes are actually serving me well after a period of um, bad addresses. Oh. I'm just about to go mad because I was listening to something. What you, you work that you produce, but fuck. There we go. Ah, right. Destination passing through an environmental zone. I know. So come out of here, turn right. Alright, that will take me to the M11. Oh, I can't just want to go back in the way I came in. Like, I mean, it worked. It was a bit you know, narrow and awful. Those things I can check out, you know what I mean? <laughs> uh, do, 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 do. Yeah, nice people there. Eh? Very friendly, considering we actually have their own trucks and do their own transport. Usually, when you go into places like that, they talk to you a bit funny because you know they haven't got the work or something like that. Yeah, which I get. You know, I'm pretty sure I'd be funny as well. You didn't need to take it that wide. Neither did you. I know it was good as gold. Very good as gold. I don't have anything to do with the uh, things that we're drinking. Oh well. Anyway. Yeah, I'm going back out of the way I came in. Screw it. I know it's good. I know where I'm going. All is well that ends well. Christ, the tattoo's on you, but I showed them off an all fair play. <sighs> Somebody please trim that back some trees. Jeez Louise. Come on, get on with it before I run someone over. Dee 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 dee. Oh, bar the head. I can't tell. Oh, Mediterranean beer. 
I mean, it's posh around here, isn't it? I've never really been to this part much. All I do is like, ooh, interesting after the training. Right. Beautiful. Then W News pulled out that car. Lovely. Not a bad job. Not a bad job at all. That's uh that was rather pleasant. Fifteen minutes that time. Nice. Right. So we're 171 miles away from the Darston Arshan. I'm gonna need to have half hour on the way annoyingly. So just pretty much but I have half hour, I'm getting them done, probably have a half hour of fleet. So I can use the loo and whatnot. And then uh got ourselves a nice little lay bar on the 303. Love a lay bar on the 303. In fact I've already got a lay bar in my head that I want just before chick laid. That's the one I want. That's the one I need. That's what I want. I've been giving my orders for tomorrow and I'm delivering this and collecting and then I'm done. So, I've decided I've had enough and I'm going to park up on my favourite play by your support chick label. Oh dear, this will do me now I'm late. Boom, potatoes. Oh, right at the front. So we should be able to sneak right in behind us. You know, if I actually clean that windscreen, that'll be a hell of a lot easier. There we go. Right, we're in. That'll do, donkey. Ah, I bought something. And I need to try it out. Get rid of that massive stack of paperwork. We need to give this a crack. What do you reckon? Well, one died. Right, let's see what we reckon then. I mean... It was 45 quid, it's Black & Decker. There are more expensive options out there, but hopefully it'll be better than the last one. If I can get into the freaking thing. There we go. Quick clean filter. You can run under water, right, okay. There's loads of that. So we have one of these. Oh, I'm guessing it's a little baggy. Oh, it's got a little baggy. Wow. Oh. Oh, isn't that nice? We have... One attachment. Is this one of those situations where I'm just going to end up throwing out more rubbish? Oh! Oh, that's clever. So it does that. Look at that. It does that. Huh. This is absolute content gold. This is for getting into my little nooks and crannies. I could do that my ass. Nice. Lovely. Now, what do we have in here then? What do you reckon? Come on. We have an Hoover. Right, that'll get into you. Reveal to me your secrets. Hope you can see me. So it has one of them. That can all go back in there. Off tip. So it's 12 volt. It's it, it's a Dust Buster Flexi Auto. It does that apparently. And I can see that going infuriating. And it cl things clip on by the looks of it. How do you empty it then? Oh! It's a good thing I checked that because I was open. Oh, don't tell me you broke it. Ah, there we go. And that's how you turn it on? Yeah, that's the on switch. What do you do? I could just read the instructions, but this is funner. I don't know what you do. I don't know what you do. I'm sure there's instructions off. Okay, no, that won't come back up now. Oh, no, it will. Okay, I don't know what you do, but I'm sure you're important. One last thing to do, really. I'm going to do this twisty thing that I'll regret twisting forever. Well, what attachment will I use first? 
What attachment shall I use first? Shall we use that one? We... Tell you what, we'll use this one. Uh, so you clip on there. Ooh. Oh, oh, I'm 31 year old man. And this excites me more than anything. All right, let's get rid of that bag. Because it is horrible in here. Okay, it works. There's a bigger nozzle, really, but yeah. I mean, it's all right. I mean, it's three point six London, not great, but not terrible. Mm. I'm actually wholly disappointed. Yeah, well, Hoover, what I can, and then dinner. Good morning. I did not sleep well last night. After all with a lay bar, apart from the fact of I forgot I was on a slant when I went to bed. So, um, yeah, I had some weird old dreams last night. Because <laughs> I was slapping my head downhill. That's something you shouldn't do. Oh, I don't know what out of here. Yeah, one dream off. I dreamt that somebody was stealing stuff off the back of the lorry with this load. To put my knee like I checked. And, um, yeah. Yeah, and then suddenly a massive swarm of flies came in and killed me. Weird. After this lorry. Beautiful. Oh, nice long load. That. Yeah, it's like 45 minutes left to get to where we need to be. I don't think we've got too busy a day today, so it doesn't really matter if I waste those minutes. So happy days, happy days, although the winter is so dirty. This truck really needs a wash, it is absolutely filthy at the moment. Mud everywhere. Well, I think the previous video. I haven't watched this since then. Oh yeah. Oh wow. Is that the moon? Hold on. I'm gonna get a better view of it when you turn this corner. That can't be the moon. Sorry. New obsession for a moment. You, you guys talk amongst yourselves. I thought that was sunrise. That's the bloody moon. It was a bit early for sunrise. Oh, I still can't see it. Oh well. Right. The Oval Hospital, let's go to that. And welcome everybody to Yeovil. It's absolutely beautiful, isn't it? Look at that. Beautiful road signs. Hmm. Ah, nearly here. Bang on time. And I'm feeling really crappy today. I won't lie to you guys. I think sleeping with my head downhill like that has really done something to me. Uh, you can probably tell in the way I'm talking because I'm talking a bit slurred, if I'm perfectly honest with you. But, oh well. We'll survive. We shall survive. There it be. Yes, I think my memory says. It's the it's dubious. I remember now. I've been here once before, and I think it has been on video. Here if we'll find the loading area now. Oh, they made that bit tight, didn't they? Jeez. That much room. That's not where the loading bay is, is it? It bloody is and all. I'm not going to be able to do that now, am I? Oh, bother. 
And obviously now I've got a half a bloody oval up my ass. That's annoying. Really need both sides of the road to be able to do that. So realistically now I'd like to be able to turn around. Or wait a minute, was that typical? Go on mate. Alright, so we're gonna try from this direction to try and get into that loading bay, because I know I can make that right hand turn, I reckon I just couldn't do it from the left because I'd destroy everything. literally just went for a housing estate. No weight limits. So we're just woking everybody up. But they should be up anyway. And I'm over one minute late now. Feels I forgot to go to save the guy's number of my phone. Usually I will save numbers in my phone so I can quickly just go, you know, call such and such with the voice thing. So I'm not trying to type out numbers. Which you shouldn't be doing anyway. Right there you go. That is how we do that. Is that pedestrian actually going? Watch where he's going. No, right. And now we've finally made it. That's what I was trying to get to. That was the whole point of his exercise. Mate, I wouldn't stand there. Ah. Morning. Morning. That's yes, sir. But yeah, yeah. I'm sorry, I actually drove past you about five minutes ago. Because I've come obviously coming from that way, and I'll say, hold on, if I was trying to turn left, I'd take out all those barriers with the arse end. So, um, so I had to go up, go through the housing estate, and come back down. <laughs> but I don't think I'm too late, am I? Um, right. Is it still going down there, is it? Right, okay. Yeah, I can back in there. It's about room of actually being able to tip, because obviously now he's in my bloody way. Uh, we can handball it off if you want. I've got them off it. That's it. If he weren't there, we'd be laughing. Lovely work. He, he might, we might have to let him finish, though. <laughs> him, I just don't want to hit him, you know what I mean? <laughs>
Right, let's make like a tree. No, and get a leaf. Or let's make like a shepherd and get the flock out of here. I really cut that up. I'm going out the wrong way. <laughs> no, it's shut me a go the normal way going out. Oh, yoga was. Right, I've got an axe to grind. I need to get some stickers. Not a step stickers. People have gotten into the habit of thinking, hmm, yes, we can use that guy's wheel as a step and scratch hell out my durabrites. So what I need to do is get four not a step stickers and stick them along the side rave just to try and deter people because it really grinds my gears. I mean, obviously, you know, your general layman's not going to know that, you know, one of those wheels is two days of my bloody wages, is he? So... You know. Oh well. Yeah. Anyway, all we're doing at the moment now is going and getting loaded for Northwest Nine. I don't know what you plan to achieve from that, my friend, but <laughs> now you've left me in a role position because I wanted to go wider to avoid you. Thanks for that. Beautiful. All right, so yeah, come out of here. That was a tree. And yeah. Just go get loaded for Northwest 9. I'll probably see you when we're heading into London. Right. Nearly there. Good morning, by the way. <laughs> yeah, next day, got back to the yard yesterday after loading and washing the lorry. Went home. Not a bad little day, but I think we're about to pay back for that. Big time. It's the point where I have two sat navs running this morning. So my HGV, all seeing, all dancing sat nav this morning was very much like, yeah, it's good, it's certain way off the A41, but it would make you hit a three and a half metre bridge, but that's fine. I'm like, how about we not do that? Um, I might as well let you go, no one else is moving. Um, yeah, oh, wait a minute, no, you're just parking. Right, gotcha. Be a while at that. Um, yeah, let's not do that and go down the M1 all the way, get Staples Corner, go back up the A5 for a mile, a mile and a half. It was shut, so I had to follow the version. And then, uh, yeah, the HGV sat nav still like, go that way. No, let's not go that way. Are you high? Jesus. But yeah, we're about an hour early at the moment, but I gave myself extra time because I was looking at this place on the map last night. I think we're about to uh, hit limits. <laughs> right, now that's finally playing ball. Stupid thing. Because we're about to go into that housing estate. 8.15 to 9.15. Oh. This is where we need to be, down here. Oh, sugar. <laughs> uh, damn. Damn and blast. <laughs> right, okay. Do you want to, like, maybe not sit behind me? I'm not getting through there, and I need to be further up that road. That is a clever thing to do in it. Sit behind the lorry that is currently reversing. Right, so basically, I'm gonna have to wait for them to get out of the way. <sighs> Look at this clever clocks. Absolute mongoloid. Right, I'm gonna give the guy a ring, let him know I'm nearby, and see what the score is.
some banksmen here who are like part time, I like a bit. Because one minute they're up your backside telling you what to do, telling you where to go, and next minute they've naffed off. And I ain't waiting around for them. watching all these other trucks out and whatnot, and he's sitting there mucking about with the fencing. You know what, I've got things to do mate. That's all the space to turn around there really. Now we have moved on here. Oh dear, to be fair it's not as bad as I was expecting it to be, because that road that the site is on, if you look at it on Google Maps, there's parked cars on the side, I was thinking I'm not meant on a lorry in there, not a hundred hell, but once we, got, once we realised it was a site, that's not so bad. Easy. Off you, sir. <sighs> so I've actually just been given my uh, next job, which uh, ain't too bad really, we're off to the city. Annoyingly, I can't take you with me, but it's going to be a pretty simple matter of. Okay, it's going to be a pretty simple matter of um, come out of here, turn right, straight down the A5. Ignore that. Straight down the A5 to um, to Marble Arch, down the Park Corner, turn left, Piccadilly, Pall Mall, up the Strand. There are other ways to go, but and there's more clever ways to go. But you know what? That way he's got a three and a half meter low bridge. Wow, cyclists just let me out. That'll do. So thank you, win. Happy days. Woo, down to Collingdale. Collingdale Station. Where Vicky was with all that load the other day. Oof, we're not know that yet. Right, anyway, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I shall see you in the next one. Stay safe and stay well.